day, you and I, because we're brand new in Christ, have the opportunity to live out our lives displaying the character and qualities of Jesus Christ. And in Colossians chapter 3, we find a perfect picture of what that looks like. Listen as the Apostle Paul describes this new man, new woman in Christ Jesus. Therefore, as the elect of God, holy and beloved, put on tender mercies, kindness, humility, meekness, and long-suffering. See, as followers of Jesus and a child of the one true God, not only are we set apart for God and loved by Him, but our character, today and every day, should reflect His. That means we should be tender and merciful toward each other. We should strive to be kind, humble, meek, and patient to those around us. Bearing with one another, Paul continued, and forgiving one another, if anyone has a complaint against another, even as Christ forgave you, so you also must do. We should live in understanding with each other, and forgiveness is key. As a new creation in Christ, exemplifying His character to a lost world, there's no way for us to justify unforgiveness. We forgive because Jesus forgave us. But above all these things, put on love, which is the bond of perfection. And let the peace of God rule in your hearts to which you were called in one body, and be thankful. But above all things, Paul says, love. Because love is the perfect bond, and because God is love. And because of God's love, His peace can rule in our hearts, and we can be truly thankful. I don't know about you, but I'm so thankful I'm not what I used to be. And I'll just bet you are too. So as we put on Christ today, let me encourage you to wrap yourself in all the qualities of his character found in Colossians chapter three. And above all, let's love each other because love is of God. Mm -hmm.